Hey there, Leo. What's up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome in if you're new. Welcome back if you're returning. This is going to be a general message, so if it resonates with you, go ahead and take it. If this is not your situation, though, go ahead and try a different message and see if that one resonates more for you. We're going to jump right on in today. We're going to start with the Romance Angel Oracles, and then we're going to get into the Light Seers Tarot. For Leo, please and thank you, Spirit. What are the messages for Leo? For Leo, please and thank you. Messages for Leo. Thank you. First card out is past life relationship. You have known each other before. If not in this lifetime, then in a previous lifetime. This is like when you meet somebody new and you're like, I know you. <laughs> you know their soul. You recognize their soul. What else do we have for Leo? Or this is Mercury Retrograde, which is on Friday. So what, in two days? The energy might just be hitting you a couple days early. This could be somebody coming back from the past. I mean, it definitely is. I just, in this lifetime, this could be an ex-back reading. We'll see, though. We'll see. Not a lot of people are into that. It's safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive. And attraction. You re attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. At the bottom of the deck is soulmate, possible twin flame. Yes, this person is your soulmate. They might even be your twin flame. Some of you guys resonate with Sisterhood of the Rose. Somebody's name could actually be Rose. Or you like smelling like Rose, Rose Hips. I don't know if this is like shampoo, candles, incense. I, there's something about roses. For Leo, please and thank you, Spirit. For Leo, tell me about past life relationship. Please tell me about past life relationship. For Leo. Seven of Cups. Nine of Cups. Okay, then. So for some of you guys, in the past, whether it's another lifetime or this one, things didn't make sense. Somebody got really confused in the relationship and walked away. But it looks like they're coming back to it because they're realizing no one's ever made me feel so welcomed, made me feel so comfortable, made me feel so hopeful for the future with them. Even though there were issues in the connection, these are issues that are worth working out. So for however long you guys have been separated or in separation, it looks like this person is deciding that they want to come back because they've never known something so happy. They've never had so much hope. They've never had so much. I'm getting so many beautiful moments with another individual. They still think about you. They still think about reaching out to you. The only thing that holds them back is the embarrassment of the embarrassment and the heartbreak that comes with the possibility that you don't respond to them reaching out to you or that you do respond, but in a negative way. So like they want to reach out to you, but they're nervous too. They're hesitating. Tell me about it is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. And I feel like this is the conclusion they're going to come to. Even if they do 
not reply or they do reply and it's negative, at least now I know and can move on with my life and try to find something that, you know, makes me feel this good, makes me feel this happy, makes me feel this comfortable. We have the full card. So yeah, they're going to go for it. They're going to go for it. Now for those of you who have been waiting for it and it's not coming in, that's because this is actually meant for you to go for it. If you've been feeling like you miss somebody, it's likely that they're having the same feelings as you. So it's a matter of who's going to say it first. Just say it. Just say it. Give it a shot. Tell me about attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. The Ace of Wands. Oh my gosh, and look at how perfectly it just landed on the table. And the star card. See, this person is so very hopeful that you guys can make this dream come true. You guys can work this out. You guys can make something happen. You're all I ever want and then some. Look at that, Nine of Cups and the Star card. You are someone's wish fulfillment. And the Emperor, see, take control of the situation in order for you guys to have this future that essentially both of you want. There's a lot of passion here too. There's something about your bodies just fit together. So like when you cuddle or something, it's like your bodies are just the perfect size to hold each other or to cuddle together or your hands just fit perfectly in each other's hands. Like... This is really beautiful energy, you guys. Is there anything else that we need to know about this connection? Please and thank you, Spirit, for Leo. Is there anything else we need to know for Leo? Yeah, this is a spark, a new passion. Somebody is so inspired. And that's fire energy. So this could be you needing to reach out to this person. Yep, Knight of Wands at the bottom of the deck when I said that. Letting your hair down and enjoying yourself, enjoying the freedom, enjoying the love, enjoying that spark, this passion. There's a whole song written between the two of you. The beat of your drum is the same beat of their drum. It's like you guys share the same beat. Yep, Eight of Wands. Communicate, take action, do this. That desire, that passion, that inspiration that you guys have with each other. Reach out, communicate to this person. For some of you guys, you're receiving this um, this notification. Like you're going to check your phone and you're going to be like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Right? They messaged me. <laughs> or this is how they're reacting when your message comes through on their phone. Absolutely gorgeous, you guys. Could also be dealing with a Taurus, Aries, Pisces, Aquarius, or Sagittarius. I'm going to leave it here, though. I hope this message helps who it needs to, how it needs to. I love you guys, and I will see you soon. Until then, please like, share, subscribe. Stay blessed. Stay beautiful. And namaste.